Now we're just returning after about uh, just over half an inch in. Pour, uh, poured ourselves a nice uh, habit, medium dry. I'm on to Dallow, if that's how you pronounce it. That's how we pronounce it up here in Aberdeen anyway. Um, going well actually. What are you thinking, Bill? <clears throat> I'm just thinking that the, uh, the burn. I'm thinking I've done too much yapping and too much preparation and let the cigar get out. Now, ain't that a clever thing to do? But never mind. Anyway, so the burn is uh, perfectly square, straight, um, ready just to uh, knock it off. Just in case it uh, goes where it shouldn't go. There you go. You mind a wee. Burn up again. So, that's amateurs, you see. It's all one man lighter, that one, Steve. You need to remember that. One man lighter. One man lighter. Look at that. Doesn't work for me either. <laughs> you know what I do? Mean? Oh, gas. Oh, I guess. He always no. does that. He comes up to my place, he's out of gas every time. Guaranteed. <laughs> Just in case you're wondering, um, Steve has been, in, in, in our own regular words, he's soaking in, soaking in blind, which means he's puffing and sucking. And he's been sucking too much, I forget to exhale. His head has grown slightly larger than my one. Balloon heat. Bah, the review of Gallimore, that dude, unless you get yourself an order. Bah heat, <laughs> as it's called, or balloon heat. Now I'm going again. Cigar's just keeping its, um, keeping its flavours. It, it, it's just got this moistness about it. It's, just, it's, it's the bark, this, the kicking back this bark, um, fresh, fresh wood. I, I think it's certainly got a strength about it. Um, it's probably progressing a wee bit um, as it should, as we've always got. Um, it's stronger than we ever started, but having said that, once we get a few puffs to start with, it's going to be a wee bit boggy anyway, if it's got any bog about it, and it's probably going to even out a bit, I would think. The reason is you, you've gotten used to the, the flavours and the strength. Yeah. I'm getting, I'm back into the, uh, what I thought was this oystery kind of thing, but okay, I think I've just, I think I've sussed it now on this one. It's those um, mushroomy, fungal kind of things. Mushroomy, very earthy I suppose as well, maybe that's where that comes from, but okay. mushroomy. But it's a strong little cigar for a, for a, I mean, I suppose you, that's maybe what you want. And a little petite robusto, you want it to be a nice, punchy cigar. Um, it's going to last you maybe something like three quarters of an hour, maybe an hour if you stretch it out, who knows. I mean, quite a fast cigar smoker myself, to be honest with you. So anything that lasts an hour is usually like a Monte Cristo number two or a, a maybe a Serie D number four, something like that. Get an hour out of, so maybe this short or one three quarters of an hour, somewhere about there, half to three quarters of an hour. But yeah, well, I've gone just the point of it, if you take off it, the first band, mm. um, for uh, some of the flavours I'm expecting. I'll bother that. No, no, I'll no, I'll 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 give the band just the, the band. Yeah, just to push up the band there, see what we've got. Well, bandito. That might perhaps spill it out if we uh, nah, I think it's going to be. Uh, 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 I think the light's going to be... The of what it says is probably totally wrong, but if you can read that and make it out yourself then... I think the light's going to be the problem get in, as the saying goes. Let me do that a wee bit later on, we'll get the band in. Yeah. We'll we'll the get whole the band, band in. Need the whole band. The strummer coming as well. Yeah. Need the whole <laughs> band. Just, just a duet. <laughs> no trios tonight, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Well, it's the best piece of cigar I've had in a while. Mm. We smoke usually we'd have a dozen cigars, of course, of course of a week, not every day, a couple of times a week we have a couple, maybe three, and maybe sneak one in between uh, the other days. Um, 
It's a Wednesday night, by the way. This is usual for me and Bill. This is uh, this is the night of the puffin, um, as it's called. We have another place that we'll maybe do something like this again at, and it's the coffin. Yeah. Very apt, eh? Coffin <laughs> and puffin. You know, so. I'm going to cleanse the pot a wee bit. Mm. A wee sherry. Have a nice sherry, are you? Oh, cheers, I'll have some too. Good health. Good health to you, sir. Mm. 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 Mm.